I've played against anyone. Uh, Since I've played against anyone. Yeah. Okay, they're jumping right into it. Um, I'm just getting their tag sword and then we'll go for it. So Zakoto going Fox. Big uh, surprise. You know, prefers to he play did this the last time he came to Garage too. Yeah, okay. Right? First play Fox Buff rather than Marth Buff. Yeah, I, makes sense. Uh, Marth Buff, it's not even like a bad matchup for Marth, I don't think. But it's not yeah, as reliable. Annoying. Yeah, right? it's annoying. As Fox, it's just kind of easy. Yeah. So like taking advantage of that, this is good. Uh, Puffs, mm. obviously, they practice the Fox matchup more than anything else, much as mm. anyone. But like, yeah. they tend to just grind their hardest matchup a lot. Um, and Freddy definitely seems pretty good at it. He's not like, like me, I tend to go into a bracket and you'll see I lose to the boxes. Mm -hmm. uh, he's not that, that way. Uh, he's pretty good about it. Um, I don't really know what Freddy's bad matchups are. Apparently Yoshi, because he doesn't want to play Buff for it. <laughs> but he won. Hey, went Fox for that one, right? Uh, and Buff. Oh, interesting. He's like a, he used to be like a true Tri-Main, but now he's just like Fox Buff. I was surprised to see Spock go out again. Um, where, what are we even looking for? Fox? So we continue the theme of the day where we only have Jiggly Buffs at this tournament. There, I think three, like three out of four matches have had Jiggly Buff on. Yeah. I don't do it intentionally. It's just the way it. It's happens. just the way it is. It's just the way it be. This place pulls them in. Ozone getting out. Me, to it Gong, early. Ozone, Sarah. I'm missing one, right? No, they just all ended up here. Oh. Zakoto coming out to a Zakuto. lead here. Zakudu. So who else do we have sitting around in this bracket? Uh, we got Ock waiting. We have and then, so we have Ock Is waiting. Is Cinder Straw still in losers, right? I don't know. He I'm lost to Seraph in Winner's side, but I don't know what the other part of that match. Do I see him looking over? To Ock. When we had our crash earlier, I lost all my tabs, and I don't want to hurt the stream by opening them, right? They did play, okay. I didn't know, like, you think about where they drop from the, you're like, how, when do they play? And we had this one side of the bracket held up for a little while. Um, it's all good now, but... I actually kind of like it, because now we're at the point in the game where everyone else gets to play friendlies, and there's just a linear part of the bracket moving forward, yeah. you know? Zakoto gives you surprisingly, like, living on that, so... Even though I'm, I don't know, self-declared uh, self now that campiest puff in Oregon. <laughs> Sarah doesn't camp as much as me, I don't yeah, yeah, she People are going to figure it out. She used like, to be a lot campier. Yeah, she was. And uh, and I yeah. used to be a lot less campy. Um, I, it's just not true anymore. Yeah. Like, uh, but when you, you, everyone thinks that, oh, this is the stage puff wants to camp because it's a big I think kind of agree. If you want to camp, you want to be able to get them when, when you have the burst movement. So like, Ozone is actually playing pretty patiently at this time. He's trying to be respectful of Fox, who messed them up pretty hard in the last game, yeah. right? But now it's like, you're giving Zakoda space, you're taking these extra lasers for no reason. Ooh. I like that down tilt. That's too close for recovery. You gotta add those pounds between. Yeah. That's how you get your max height. Like, doubles it. It's crazy. Even in those small streets where you're not that far away, your jumps just don't do that. Pound is huge. I like to turn around grab yeah. attempt. He was expecting to run up grab himself, I think. Sakoto coming out, coming out to a clean stop lead here. Yeah. Ooh. And we actually just saw the exact opposite. Sakoto did do the grab I was just talking about. Like, expecting yeah. to run up grab. Not gonna happen. Ooh, I, actually, I really respect that, though. Those are he, he, I respect it, though. I saw him play yesterday, right? We see those situations where he's chasing the platform and he goes for those reds. Every once in a while, it's puffy. Will this rest hit? Right? I can't quite no. tell. If you go for him and you miss it, you're dead. You're on a platform now, too. Like, yeah. no matter what comes out, you're over. Um, I saw, like, two of the times that happened yesterday at the PSU we did. So, see him have a little restraint there. So, I'm going to go for the grab again. I'm gonna, I want to go for the... Uh, I like to edge guard. One of the first things that was like, you have, you have those things in your brain, you're like, that's the thing I do. Right? Mm -hmm. The first one was the virtue ladder, up throwing all the way to the top platform, <laughs> and then getting the hard VI away, and then resting it. Nice. Oh, beautiful. And that's not He's gonna, gonna kill. Live, yeah, not yet. His not DI has been yet. great on those, but they are happening at low percentages. That's when you want rest, of course, because you're trying to get the most out of your rest damage. 
It's getting away with them, like, past where you expect. I usually account that, like, on any other stage, I usually count that Nair grab dress will kill, right? Mm -hmm. There's game two. Uh, but when you're on Dreamland, I actually think about that more specifically. I just go, uh, Nair grab rest, not gonna kill their mm -hmm. guys, great. It won't, it won't do it. Yeah. Um, Crown Puff, really. Switching it back to Dreamland. Yeah, unsurprising. Um, it's actually, you know, it's like it's not surprising because it's just a as a Jigglypuff player, you're told you're like, oh, Dreamland's amazing for you. Um, yeah. And it's a good stage for you, given like certain options being done really, really well. When you're getting camped, this stage oh, means yeah. your moves kill low. At, they take longer to kill. Nair grab rest doesn't mm -hmm. kill anymore. And you're gonna get lasered, and you can't punish yeah. them for doing it because they have the range to get away. And He's gonna live. Uh, no, yeah. I don't think Bress has killed the fox once this set. Actually, once this, once this one, set. I mean, well, not on Dreamland. I don't think Fox okay. decided to thrust the once on Dreamland. No, he hasn't. Yeah. Uh, you have to really relearn your percentages to have a rest here. Oh, that was a back Ooh. Well, okay. As a, if that was the back air, that could have led to a kill, but it ended up leading to a kill anyway. And they were kind of an awkward timing, I think. Ooh, I like. I would have done everything the same right there. <laughs> Attempt to up air on the fall, land, try to up tilt <laughs> to get up, miss, whip grab. I would have done every part of that. Um, I want to talk more about stage pick though, right? Yeah. So like, I'm not like, I'm not rebelling against the puff code, right? I just don't think Dreamland's actually always the answer. Yeah. Like yeah, your, your moves aren't killing because the stage is too big, right? You're getting camped and spaced out where you're not getting your options out as much, right? Oh, there we go. Um. Like, what part of that makes you treat that like a counter pick? Ozone, Ozone's an aggressive player, right? Uh -huh. The high top, you, that's not, that's a good thing, right? But I don't know, that one's pretty big, right? That benefits you pretty well. Your edge guards are pretty good. You still get all the scoop benefits in the ledges in this stage, right? I'm, I'm a big fan. But, or if you're a maniac like me, I'll go Yoshi sometimes. <laughs> oh, wow. I got counter pick Paul. Palti Yoshi's yesterday? No, it was a uh, good huh. And one. What was the matchup? Fox Puff. If I don't, and I couldn't go okay. to Dreamland, right? Keep in mind, but he's camping me the whole time, and I was like, no, I don't want that. I guess it makes sense. And then he couldn't laser camp me, and he got punished because that was oh. almost sick. Almost. So the idea, right? So if you're on Ledge's Puff and you don't double lasering, you can, like, grab, tourney winner, read the timing, not read the timing, recognize the timing that they're committed to a double laser, and reach, like, half the stage on Yoshi's, right? I was a little scared. That's it. Yeah. Damn. Zakoto doing it with Fox today. Putting in the work. Zakoto's gonna stay right there and he's gonna play off.